Ghosts by Raina Telgemer. August. One double back combo, one cheese back with fries, a double Napoleon shake. Don't forget my orange just soda. Here you go, girls. Do they have a double back burger in our new town, Dad? I don't think so, Cat. They only have them down here in Southern California. What are we gonna even eat in our new town? We're moving up north and to the coast. Dad got a new job, but we all know the real reason we're going. My little sister Maya, she's not a healthy kid. I'm trying not to be selfish. My bubby is cooking dinner tonight. You want to come over? Oh, right. I forgot. But it's hard. You okay back there, cat? Yeah, I'm okay. Maya has sinking fibrosis. It's a thing you're born with. It affects breathing and digestion. How about a little music? And there's no cure. Mom and Dad are dragging us to this gloomy place, Bahia de la Luna, California. They say the sun only shines there 62 days of the year. When I heard that, I'd said, Ew, I'd rather die. Which didn't go over very well. I'm gonna miss Ari and Maddie and Hiba. Of course, I don't want to die, but I want Maya to be as healthy as possible. Duh. You mean all of my friends? What about your friends? They're my friends too. Cat? Yes, Maya, they're your friends too. This is it, girls. The green one? No, the little red one. Cat, isn't this place so cool? Hmm. I can't believe we get to live here. Look, look, look. The ocean is so close. I'm freezing. I'm going inside. It's so dark in here. What do you think, Cat? It's dark. It's perfect. Cat! Come downstairs. Come see my new room. Okay, I'm coming. Hey, it's cozy in here. Watch this. Cannonball! <coughs> it's about time for a breathing treatment, Maya. The vest helps loosen the muckus in her lungs. Her soul doesn't need any loosening, though. Mom? Maya's vest just blew a few, sweetie. You okay up there? Yeah, I just... I just don't know this house very well yet. Why don't you take your little sister to explore the town while we work on getting the power back? Ooh, there's a secret pathway! Maya, we don't know what's down there. <sighs> Maybe this path will lead to us. Kitty! Don't touch it. Why not? It's so cute. Because you know what they say about letting a black cat cross your path. It's bad luck. And you've had enough bad luck lately. Come on, let's see where this thing leads. Brr. Whoa. Cat, look. This survey leads into the beach. 57, 58, 59. There's 59 steps. Race ya. Wait. My, that was dangerous. Sit, cat. Breathe it in. Now let it out. I guess your favorite princess song gives good advice. Oh, we should take a picture and send it to Ari. Take one for me. Oh, there's an arcade over by the boardwalk. Let's go see if they have any good games. Never mind, it looks creepy and dark in there anyway.
Let's just go home. Maya? Maya? Maya! Maya? Where are you? Maya? Uh, so does... Oh. We've got to get out of here. It isn't safe. But cat... See, the dust, the, the, the dust is bad for your lungs. What was that? There's something there. Hello? You're early. The ghost tour doesn't start until three. Ghost tour? Don't listen to this kid, Maya. He's just messing with us. But, but, there's no such thing as ghosts. You must be new in this town if that's what you believe. Once you've actually lived in Bahia de Aluma, you'll change your mind. Well, nice knowing you. Goodbye. But ghosts aren't real, Maya. He's just trying to scare us. I hope. It's sunny back home. Do you get new clothes for school? Maya and I met this weird boy yesterday. Katrina, let's go. Where are we going again? I told you, the neighbors invited us over for dinner. Aw, uh, do I have to go? We should all get to know the house, see the neighborhood, meet new people. Which neighbors are these? The Calaveras's. Daddy met Mr. Calaveras at the record shop. He used to be a really famous band, Mr. Senor. I've never heard of them. You! 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 Um, hello! Bienvenidos, welcome! I see you have met my son, Carlos. Hi, Javier. This is my wife, Leona, and this is Katrina. Kat and Maya. Your turn, Kat? No, that's okay. Why not? It's not a good idea to get, it's not a good idea to get so worked up. Here. Take them. Come on. That's the spirit. Cut it out. Oh, wow. It's good, right? My mom makes the best tamales in town. They're okay, I guess. Is this a family recipe, Joanna? Yes, my mother's. Girls, I wish you'd have tasted your grandma's tamales. You would have loved them. My mother passed away shortly after Karina was born. That's such a shame. Maybe we'll see her on Dia de los Matos. Is everything about ghosts with you? Jeez. Dia de what? Day of the Dead. You know, like Halloween. No, girls. November 1st. It's a day to welcome back the spirits of the lo loved ones we lost. I haven't celebrated in years. Oh! This town takes it pretty seriously. Do you guys have a parade or something? <laughs> we go far beyond parades here. But it's just pretend, right? You could never actually believe in ghosts come back to visit, right? You know the mission at the top of the hill? I know there are missions all over the coast. Ours is basically a doorway to the spirit world. Oh, sure. <clears throat> I hope you all saved room for dessert. So, what are the ghosts like? Some, like my brother Jose, aren't too different from when they were alive. Because of the um, accommodation weather in this town. You mean the fog? Yes, because of the fog, the ghost see our town is the perfect place to hang out. We want the spirits to feel welcome on their special day, so we throw them the big party with best music, dancing, and food. A party? Can we go? Of course, everyone who lives in B Bahia de la Luna is invited. I just want to go home. Thank you for dinner, Joanna. Everything was delicious. My pleasure. It's just the wind and fog. It's just the wind and fog. Because of the fog, the ghost here town is the perfect place to hang out. Everybody in, 
Hurry. Good. Phew. Ready for your nightly ritual, Maya? Yeah. Because psychic fibrosis affects digestion, Maya doesn't always get enough nutrients from food. Can I shake it up tonight, Daddy? Oh. So she has to get them another way. Ready? Yup. You take your pills? Yup. Okay, night, Maya Lita. Night, Daddy. Cat, everything okay? I don't like it here. Aw, missing Ari and your friends back home? Yeah, it's just... I mean, I'm glad we moved because it's better for Maya's health. But everyone here is totally obsessed with ghosts. Don't you think it's weird? How do you know there weren't as many ghosts in your old town? You just never noticed them. Good night. Ah. I know I saw something in that tree. There. Silly cat. Mom, how come you never talk about grandma? Your abuelita and I didn't have the best relationship when I was growing up. Why? She bought a lot of old-fashioned ideas with her when she immigrated from Mexico. But I was your typical stubborn American teenager. I wanted to do things the modern way. Morning, cat. Mm. So when she tried to teach me how to make her mother's recipes, I chose to microwave frozen dinners. She tried to teach me my, the honor of my ancestors during Dia de los Metos, but I wanted to go trick-or-treating with my friends for Halloween instead. But trick-or-treating is awesome, couldn't you do both? Not in her mind. I feel bad about it now, but I never even learned to speak fluent Spanish. So I guess after your abuelita died, a lot of old traditions died with her. Concha cat? What's a concha? Joanna sent them home with us last night. Mmm, not bad. Kinda like a donut. Your grandma made them all the time when I was little. Cat, can I see your phone? Why? You gonna play a Hungry Bird or something? No, I'm tasting Carlos. What? Did you give him my number? Yeah, so I could text him. Duh. Later. Maya's handiwork. I'm a better texter than that. What are you guys up to? Carlos, we're making in a friend of our Abuelita. Come see. Very nice. But in a friend that needs more decorating. Oh, yeah. I found this neat driftwood. Some purple flowers. Ooh, I'll get you some marigolds when they bloom. The official flower of the dead. Oh, and check out the seashell. A seashell? Hmm, keeping seashells in your house is bad luck. It is? Yeah. Unless you wanted to learn the disconnected undead. The what? Drowned pirates, revenge seekers, ship captains. Oh, are those the guys part of the ghost tour? Yeah. Okay, that's enough. No more ghost talk. But cat. Yeah, but cat. We have to take the tour. Please, please, please. No. Why are you afraid they're going to get you? No. So just come. Live it all. It's really just like a history lesson about our town. No. I'll bring you some more of my mother's concha. The next day. Ready? Pastry? Here you go, Mrs. Alain de Delar. Tell your mother gracias. He sure is a nice boy, honey. Now, normally, I charge $20 per person on our tour. Oh, but I'm gonna give you a, t give you two friends and family discount. That means it's free, but only if you promise not to get too freaked out. Fair enough. The arcade used to be a bathhouse for the town's residents. Eventually, games and amusements were added, which soon became more popular than the baths. 
Can you still play the games? You can try. But the ghosts have rigged them so humans can't win. Oh. Old movies only. This place burned down in the 1937s, but was rebuilt two years later. They say the projectionist died in the fire. His body was never found, but sometimes his phantom image shows up in the film prints. Ghost cruise ships and ghost pirate ships that are here on Dia de los Muertos. A beacon to light the ghost ships safely to port. The light doesn't always work, which means more shipwrecks, which means more ghosts. These were painted in the 1960s and 70s. Mostly the paintings of direct revolutionary leaders from Mexico. But they, Carlos, are we going to meet any ghosts today? Oh, well, they usually can't be seen this early in the year. But as we get closer to autumn, they'll be noticeable. Told you he was lying. I'm not lying. Ghosts are really hang out here. I can prove it. No, that's okay. Prove it. Maya. I have to talk to a ghost cat, Rena. What do you want to ask it about? I want to know what happens when you die. Uh-huh. And I want to fly. But it's not like that's ever going to happen. Dying is a pretend cat. It's real. Listen, it's not a usually part of the tour, but I can take you to the mission. It's where the ghost world and ours most closely overlap, so heading up there is our best chance of making contact. Let's go. Cat? I have never wanted two people to be more wrong in my entire life. Here, my, take my sweatshirt. We're almost there. We really lucked out today. This is great ghost catching weather. Maya's not supposed to chase anybody. Her lungs can't handle it. And neither can mine. Wait up, you guys. <sighs> Ow. Maya? Whoa. Maya? Carlos? Hello? Are you guys there? Ah! Am I seeing things? Maya's going to be amazed when I tell her I saw... Oh my gosh! Maya! Let's get out of here! Cat! Just go with it. You can leave if you want to. I'm staying. Then I'm staying here too. Why are they just sitting there like that? They can see a little shy around people they don't know. Do I drink this? No, just hold it. Cat, I can really see him. He seems friendly. Hi. Most of the people buried here are from Mexico. So they like when you speak Spanish to them. Oh, okay. Hola. <laughs> The wind is crazy. The ghosts love it though. They can't breathe on their own, so they absorb the essence of the world breathing around them. That's why you can see more ghosts on windy days. So are these, um, friends of yours? These are all ancient ghosts, dead for centuries. They usually recognize me, but they can be slow to trust new people. They seem to be hitting off right away though. So, does she have that ability? Yeah, Cat, this is awesome! Maya, be care- Whoops. Maya! Get away from her! You can't have her breath, she needs it! 
Karina, I don't think this is all your fault. We've got to get her to the hospital. Just breathe, Maya. Just breathe. Want me to help carry her? No. Hello, 911? A small, it's most likely her attack was brought by by the cold. That and overexerting herself. Karina, what were you thinking? Taking Maya hiking without breaking her medication. I'm sorry, she just really wanted to go right then. And I thought, we expect more from you, Kat. I know. So I'll drop you off and then I'm going back to the hospital to spend the night with your sister. Daddy will bring the car home in an hour or so. Will you be okay here alone for a little while? Yeah. Hello, Katrina. We brought dinner. Thank you. It's what neighbors are for. Why did I let those ghosts get so close to her? It's not your fault. Ghosts just like a little overly excited by kids. Their energy is like a breath of fresh air. So you knew this would happen? Not exactly. If you share a tiny bit of your own breath, sometimes they'll speak to you. Speak to you about what? Coming to join them? No, they just... Look, I'm sorry, okay? I didn't know she was gonna get hurt. I'm her big sister. I'm supposed to protect her. Kat, listen. No, leave me alone. And stay away from my sister. Fair enough. September. Hey. Oh, hey. How's your sister doing? She's still in the hospital. I'm sorry. No, really. Um, excuse me. Phew. Hi, uh, what color is that? Pumpkin spice shimmer. It's cute, isn't it? I got it on sale at the half mart in town. Yeah. My name's Siu Young. Are you new here? I moved to Bahia de la Luna from Intervigon two years ago. I'm Kat. I didn't like it here at first. Too much fog, not enough froyo. But now I love it. What about you? <laughs> Definitely not enough froyo. This is amazing. I've been talking to her for three minutes and she hasn't brought up ghosts once. So, what do you do for fun in this town? Well, the Harvest Festival is soon and that's pretty fun. And have you heard about the midnight party on November 1st? Yeah, I'm not going. Oh, you have to, it's great. Last year, I met the cutest boy I've ever seen. You did? Yes. Too bad he's been dead for over a century. Is the breathing too per permanent, Mom? We're not sure yet, sweetie. You know, psychic fibrosis is deventinable, so her lungs will probably keep getting worse as she grows up, not better. Uh-huh. However, this is Maya we're talking about. Every time she has a setback, she seems to re -roop everything with twice the positive a attitude. It's too quiet when you're sick. And then the level three boss, come on. Do you have the cheat code? I refuse to use cheat codes, out of principle. So young, that's the only way to beat it. It can't be the only way, right? Cat, you okay? Looks like someone's got a crush on Mr. Ghost Tour. No, 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 no. Hey, what's that on your napkin? Please forgive me. Ooh, is that a, a sorry for? A lover's quarrel? No, no, no. So, do you guys want to study for... Mr. Nakazawa's test together after school? Good idea. I haven't even looked at my notes yet. Probably just the cat again. 
I can't let her follow me home to Maya. That was too close. What do you want? Maya's not ready. Neither am I. I know it's not exactly double back burger. That's okay, Dad. Thanks. They could only use me at the office tonight. We're at crunch mode this week. We'll clean up. Will you take out the garbage cat? What are you doing here? I thought I told you to. <sighs> Please. Just stay away from my house. You're not welcome here. Who are you shouting at? Just a stray kitty. Cat? Yeah? Are the spears here? I want to talk to them. Nobody here. You hear that music, cat? Uh-huh. It's pretty. October. That's weird. It feels like the sun is shining. I must still be dreaming. Cat! It's sunny, it's sunny, the fog went away, it's sunny morning! Get up, get up, get up! Dad said he's taking a shopping for costumes. Come on, get up. Oh, I can't. What? Why not? I'm going out with my friends today. You made friends? Don't act so surprised. And so? Gosh, Maya would love this. Who's Maya? Oh, she's just a friend of mine from back home. Hey, look, cat, it's you. I, I don't get this. Who is this? Why did she have my name? You don't know that Katrina? She's a super famous Day of the Dead icon. Really? You see her everywhere this time of year. And skeletons in general. People dressing up like the dead helps visiting spirits feel less awkward, out of place, you know? You worry about ghosts feeling self-conscious? It's like showing up to a party without your clothes on. Except they're showing up without skin, eyeballs, a digestive system, fingernails. Cat! Hey, we went to costume shopping to the Halloween store. I got so much cool stuff. Are these your friends? I'm Kat's sister, Maya. Sister? What's the matter? Nothing, it's just... You told them about my breathing tube, right? You... You told them I exist, right? Trick or treat? I'm sorry I didn't tell my friends about you. It was selfish of me, but... You didn't want me around, I get it. No, it's not that. I guess I needed something of my own. Something that was just for me. Here. Um, thanks? How's Maya doing? She gets a little better at each day. Well, tell her I said hello. Cat, who was that? Carlos, he... Oh, my flowers! Your flowers? For Grandma's ofrenda. Carlos promised to bring me some more deagles. They're the perfect finishing touch. You're right, they really are. You hear that, Grandma? We're ready for you. Or not. Late October. And just like that, it was Halloween night. <gasps> you look so cute! Like a real honest-to-goodness Katrina. 
First trick or treater. Howdy. Is Sue Young here? You're supposed to say trick or treat. <laughs> Maya, this is Sue Young's brother, Jay. We're taking him out tonight. Come in. Thanks, partner. Hmm. This isn't fair. Maya is just too risky to let you go outside in the cold. You know that. I'll give you half my candy. Three quarters, all chocolate. Oh, fine. So, Mrs. Alain Delar, is it okay if Kat comes with us to the Day of the Dead party at midnight, right? Um, well, isn't that a little past your bedtime? It's tradition. The whole town will be there. Not the whole town. I suppose if most grown-ups go, too, it'll be okay. What was the point in moving here, Mom? What do you mean, honey? We come to Bahia de la Luna so I could be healthier, right? So I could actually do stuff. I wanted to go trick-or-treating tonight so bad. I know, Maya. We're doing the best we can, but your doctor's advice to stay inside and rest. But I don't want to rest. It's not like I'm ever going to get better. So why not let me have fun while I can? Meanwhile, trick or treat. Oh, great costumes. Oh, wait, I was going to suggest we avoid this. Trick or treat. Hey, everyone, you all coming to the party tonight? Of course. Wouldn't miss it. Cat? It's Cat Rena? And no. He totally likes you. So you've changed your tune about ghosts, huh? What? The altar in your house? Oh. Well, that's just for my grandma. Maya really wanted to build her a little ofrenda. She thinks she'll meet her spirit tonight or something. Yeah, but Kat, you open your door to one ghost, you're basically inviting every ghost to come inside. What? No. That's kind of the point, to welcome wandering spirits. It's true. It's what the good neighbors do. You guys, I gotta go. But we'll see you later, right? Ma'am? I don't know. Bye, Jay. Bye, Rai. Bye, Su Young. Bye forever, Katrina's courage. Everything looks all right. Kat, is that you? It's me. Is everything okay here? Everything's fine. We're gonna just watch a few scary movies. Sounds good. And so... I'm going to bed. Scary inside, scary outside. Cat, why are you avoiding the party? I have to stay here with you to protect you from stuff. What stuff? Grandma? No, I'm not exactly afraid of grandma spirit exactly. Mom's here, so if grandma comes, they'll both be happy. So? I don't want to go back to the mission. I never want to see the ghosts again. Not after what happened last time. Cat, I can't go even though I want to, but you can. The ghosts hurt you. Not on purpose. I'm scared, okay? What happens if I die, Cat? Will you be afraid of my ghost too? I don't know. Please, Kat, go back to the mission. But don't do it for me. Do it for yourself. Deep breath in and let it out. That's weird. No wind tonight. No ghosts either. Just witches, devils, ghouls, and vampires. Ready to rock? I hope so. It's so still tonight. Do you think the ghosts will come? This is incredible. But I still don't get how the ghosts just go with it.
Did you see Pablo? Isn't he cute? Yeah. That's Signora Monzona. She used to be the mayor. Hola. Over there is Sal, a real pirate. That group of women were fashionistas in the 1940s. Some of them can speak and some of them can't. But if you give them a tiny bit of yourself, you will never be lacking in spirits to call your friends. Grandma? Oh my gosh, Abulita, is that really you? It's me, Katrina. Oh, right. You're not really my grandmother, are you? I guess I really was hoping to see her tonight. And for a second, you looked exactly how I imagined her. I'm sorry to bother you, Senora. I hope it's okay if I sit here with you. Hmm? My... my spirit? You think my spirit is good? I guess it's hard not to feel good when you're surrounded by so much life. Cat! Carlos? I'm glad you made it. Me too. Listen, I never got a chance to thank you for my... Yeah! <laughs> Karina, this is my uncle, Jose. Hi! But you're just... I mean, you're... I'm eight! She's a friend of yours, Carlos? Yes, Carlos is a friend of mine and my sister's. Is your sister here too? Listen, I need to go to chat with the band. Tio Jose, will you hang out with Cal for a little while? How do you do die, Jose? I don't know. You don't remember it at all? Do you remember being born? No. Dying's the same. One minute, it was me. The next minute, I was still me, but like this. But that ha must have been terrible for your family. All I know is they haven't forgotten me or else I wouldn't be here like this tonight. And even though they're a whole year older th the time I visit, they always want to play. That's right. Speaking of playing, Encore, encore! Our Mar Maraca player had to go home for the night. Wanna say, cat? <laughs> this is fun. I wish Maya could have met you. You'd get along like peas in a pod. The day of the dead has just begun. Let's bring the party to her. Come on. It's kind of a long way to walk. Who said we're gonna walk? Wait, what? Are you ready? I hope so. Wait for me too, Jose. I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead. I'm... I'm not dead? Ready? Ready. Away we go! Hey, good to see you, neighbors! Now this is a ghost tour. Cannonball! This way, right? Maya! Shh, my parents are sleeping. Maya, oh my gosh! Wake up, wake up, Maya, please! Cat? Oh, thank goodness you're all right. What happened? <laughs> I ate all your chocolate. For once, I don't even mind. Anyway, there's someone I'd like you to meet. Um, hola. You must be Maya. What is it? Jose, if I die, Cal will be all alone. She's terrible at making friends. Or at least she used to be. But I'm dead, and that didn't stop your sister from becoming my friend, did it? I guess that's true. So you think I'll still make new friends too? You lose certain things when you die, but not everything. 
And there are certain benefits to being a ghost. There are? We can run faster, jump higher, and dance longer than any mortal. Especially if a little help from the world around us. Although, we do get a little winded sometimes. Oh, wanna try my breathing tube? Maya, I'm not sure if... It's okay, Kat. I'll just put it here. All right, come on, Carlos, I'm ready to fly. I suppose we should get going to back to the party. Another kiss for Ada's strength? Yeah! And one for you, too. I saw that cat's in love. So did you leave any good candy for me? Um, there are a couple of boxes of raisins. Grandma never came, did she? I don't think so. Hmm. Maybe next year? Next year, you've got to come to the party with me. I met the cutest old lady. And you would not believe how talented Carlos' dad is. Do you hear that? I don't see anything. Wait a second, Kat. Do you see that? There's someone coming toward the house. More trick-or-treaters? No. Oh, it's the kitty. Hi, kitty. Should we let it come and sit? Cat, do you smell that? Yeah, it smells like... Mom, wake up. Come to the dining room. Did you girls cook? It smells great in here. We didn't cook. But who... Who did... Why? Just go with it. Thank you for listening. I hope you enjoyed the book. If you want to listen to more audiobooks, head on over to my channel. And while you're there, why don't you subscribe? Thanks again, and I wish you all a good day.